Thanks for watching Goosey Goggles VR. My name's Dan. Let's jump into some Into the Radius. Okay, so we're back into Into the Radius. Um, this video will be more of a long form media where we can really jump into some of the gameplay of the game. Uh, maybe we can jump in, start off a mission, um, see how far we get, and see if we can complete it. So, this is where you start off in Into the Radius. Um, it's like a little compound, um, looks a bit like a factory. On the inside, as we go in, on our left, we find our, our safe house where we can store all our gear. Today we're going to start our mission, and you can see you've accepted loads of missions to do over in this um, this area, the Balot Balotki village. So that's what we're going to do. So equipment-wise, we're taking out our AK. We've got a red dot on it, fully loaded magazine, ready to rock. Sidearm-wise, we've got our Glock, the G17. We've got ammo in our pouch. Ammo on our belt, in our bag, we've got some food, health packs, some flares and grenades. Um, ugh. So when you come out of our safe house and we go outside, there's three areas we can go to. Um, straight ahead, to our right or to our left, and they each um, end up in different parts of those map segments. Um, I've only ever been forward and right, there's one to the left but I haven't been there yet. But our missions take us this way. Alrighty, so if we have a look at our map, we've just started off down here. Our missions should take us... Ah, wrong section of the map. So it looks like I should have went this way. Let's go. So here we are out in one of the map segments I spoke about earlier. On my back is a map, and we can see we've just been plonked in over here. And one of our missions is right here, so that's great. M3. M3 requires us to find the special rift, destroy it and bring it back to the broken shard. I can hear someone near me. Just one of these guys, no problem. No need to waste the ammo on the central bit. If you don't destroy this, he'll come right back. So you've got to make sure you finish him off. Oh no. Luckily the two guys behind didn't notice. Um, even though I'm not using a silencer, so that's great. Whoa, some of them are really faint, like this guy. Oh, hairy moments. When you're out in the wild, you can put ammo back into your clips by putting the um, clip to the ammo box, and it'll automatically put the the um, ammo inside the clip. I can see someone right around that corner. These guns are pretty powerful. So hopefully by now you'll see what I mean in my review when I say it's less of a survival game and more of an action game. The only survival elements really are your health and your stamina and hunger. So this yellow bar is my hunger level, so I'm very hungry right now and it's preventing my blue bar from filling up. So if I ingest a little snack bar, you'll see the yellow start to dissipate and then the blue starts to fill its space. We can only sprint for however much blue we have. Seeing a special rift anywhere. Ah, is it above me? I think it's above me. Hmm, just a knife. Hmm, teddy bear. So these strange objects are just collectibles in the game. They don't do anything. Um, they're just good for your, your safe house. We'll put them in there for later. So 
So I've yet to find this special rift. Um, I really can't find it. Not a clue where it is. Find the heavy helix. Let's try this one, M2. M2 straight ahead at this facility here. So the colours in Into the Radius can be quite muted. It's not the most colourful game in the world. Um, I don't mind so much. The graphics are great. Um, oh, these things are just so creepy. So these little detectors will flash when there's anomalies nearby. Sorry, artifacts. Anomalies, artifacts. That's an anomaly. We're hunting for artifacts. Um, it will go green when you're heading in the right direction. And it will flash when you're close. You can see these anomalies, these static anomalies that get in the way. We have these little uh, cartridge casings and you can throw them. And they'll set off any uh, anomalies in your way. And there it is. So we can trade this in for money and buy new guns at the shop back at base. Now to find my way out. Just through the grass. Can you see him? Ah, I think he's noticed me. Oh my god, I panic so hard. Oh, I'm the worst panicker. That's going to get me killed one day. Looks like the objective's just up here on the left. If I follow the railway, I'll get there. Let's take a minute to talk about the radius. So the radius has a mechanic where this timer counts down, and when it counts down, it respawns all the enemies in the areas and sends you back to a random spot. So you really don't want to be caught outside when the radius goes off. You want to make sure you're back at camp. Good little mechanic. Good fun. Find artifact. Find artifact the heavy helix. That's good English. Just find the heavy helix, right? I know there can be enemies in here. So I have to be careful. Instantly I can hear them. It's just out here. Aha. Gotcha. Oh, that guy had a shotgun. Whew, unfortunately, you can't pick up the enemy. Oh, don't take chances with those guys. Sure, somebody just shot at me. That was not a good time for that. in here surely. Whoa. So this is the deal. This is the um this is one of the objectives. Shoot that. Collect that and trade that in. Tense under here, isn't it? No. I found an artifact, but it's not the artifact we're looking for. Just trade that in for money. Unfortunately, it's not the uh, objective. Ow! This is the objective one, we can tell that because it's green. Also an Into the Radius. You get these little loot crates, which you can open up and get new weapons. Like a shotgun. 
double barrel. Nice. Let's go see how this double barrel shotgun works. I know there's someone around here. Creepy girl talking. There's one. Come out to play. It's just around that corner. I don't want to risk firing. Don't fumble now. Got no health left. Probably gonna need two. Let's do it. No more ammo than that. Time to get out of it. This is risky. Let's do it. So the climbing mechanics feel quite natural. They're not bad. You can quite easily get yourself out of areas like that by climbing up little rails. One slug, one buckshot. So looking at objective three that we're like next to also, we need to find the special rift, destroy it and bring back the broken shard. But it looks like there's two of them. I think I got one here. I'm thinking the second one is over here in these woods. So let's make our way over there. See how well he dealt with my uh, double barrel. Hmm, creepy. I think my mission is just over there by that body. We'll use our shells to get around the anomalies. So I can see there's a bit of a gap just to the left of this one. And I think this is our objective. Yep, mission complete. Looks like we're near the second helix for mission two. Um, but it's in this artifact field. So we use our shells to the best ability to make our way through. Hmm, no route here. Those things will kill you real fast. Not now. Ugh. Always make sure you're loaded. Squeeze through. And there it is, there's our second objective. Whoa. Someone near me? Oh, I need to get out of here, this is creepy. There he is. There's two of them. Looks like I'm all out of shells. Alright, let's head back to home through this little gate here and then we'll finish up this gameplay. Great, here we are back at base. We can start trading in those goods that we found um, and also our mission objectives like those heavy helixes we managed to find. We didn't complete a few of our mission objectives, but that's okay, we can come back and do those another day. Um, we managed to complete Radius Treasures and Sample Courier. Let's go hand them in. So inside my base we have this delivery centre. We just um, mark the objectives where we have. 
hand in the goods. This is what happens when it gets a bit busy. <laughs> Gotta dig in. There it is. And we mark this for completion. Complete. Thanks a lot for watching. That was Into the Radius. Now I'm back at base. I'm going to chill out and play some darts. <laughs> See you later.